Hey guys, um, so today I'm going to be wearing my glasses because I can never see my viewfinder. Uh, my sight is pretty bad. I am, I don't know what one I am. On the one where you can't see far away, I think that I'm short-sighted, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't know. But I can never see the viewfinder. Um, and today I'm not going to be like, because obviously I can't wear my glasses while I'm putting my makeup on. But today we're just doing some unboxings and like hauls and stuff, so I'm gonna wear them today. Anyway, today we're going to be going through the Bath and Body Works Halloween collection. I got some stuff from there and I'm so excited. First things first that I want to talk about actually isn't from Bath and Body Works, it's from Dusk. I already have done my Dusk like Halloween haul, um, but then we were out shopping a couple of weeks ago and um, my mum got me this so I just want to quickly show you because I wanted to show it on camera but I didn't know what video to put it in so this is a little Ambrose and Peppo pumpkin LED it's only $25 it was on sale so and I don't know I just think it's so cute it's like look at them and then you turn them on and I just think that is the cutest thing that I've ever seen in the whole world um so yeah, just wanted to show you guys that, that I got those, but yeah, I just think they're super cute. Anyway, I love them, and even though it's like Halloween, I know that I'm gonna keep these up all year, so anyway, now let's get on to the Bath Body Works haul. First things first. Um, the first candle we have here is called Midnight Spell, and it has this beautiful snake on the top. The tail of mine broke off, and he's floating around in the box somewhere. Um, so. I would like to say that I will super glue him back together, but I'm not going to do that. So he's still super cute. So yeah, this is Midnight Spell and this is Mystic Air, Moonlit, Moonlit Woods and Crystal Amber. So beautiful. I love the Halloween collection this year. I think it all looks so pretty. This smells so good. Oh, it's like so kind of fresh and like mysterious and like just absolutely incredible I don't even know how to describe it but this is probably one of my favorite ones from the collection this year I think it smells incredible the next candle that I got was pumpkin carving this one is freshly carved pumpkin spiced pumpkin seeds and smooth brown sugar it smells so good exactly what you would expect it to smell like just super like sweet and nice and warm and pumpkiny love it and I love the little jar I think it is so cute it's got all these uh, I feel like I can't tell if it's it looks like that stained glass so it makes me wonder that when it's like lit if like it'll like shine through do you know what I mean I hope so because that'll be really cool yeah it's super super pretty next we got moonlit graveyard this one is tombstone moss cold foggy air and eerie incense um once again the packaging they've just absolutely nailed it this year i just think it is it's so it's kind of hard to see because it's reflecting but it's so cute and then on the top we have a little ghosty oh, it's super fresh it does smell kind of like dirt like i know that like but in a good way um like it smells very like earthy and like i don't know super nice though um, Moonlit Graveyard is still my, f no, sorry, not Moonlit Graveyard, the first one, Midnight Spell is still my favourite, but this one is really nice as well. It's super, like, fresh, but it smells a bit more like, I don't know, like, more like the earth kind of thing. I know that sounds weird, but I don't know any other way to describe it. It's really unique. I don't think I have a candle that smells like that. Next, we have a classic. We have Vampire Blood, and I'm pretty sure that I still have one of these from last year or the year before in the packaging. This is Blood Red Strawberry, Midnight Blooming Jasmine, and Dark Transylvanian Plum. It smells really, really good. I don't know what it smells like, but it's... Okay, really random. <laughs> if you're from Australia and you've ever had mini weeds, they're like the little mini wheat beaks, but they've got like the little, um, little like chewy things in them, like little fruit. That's what they smell like. Kind of. That's what it just reminded me of. But this smells really good. 
It's still super fresh, but also has that like sweetness to it. Oh, I really want to eat it. It reminds me of mini wheat so much. That is really weird. But like in the best way possible. <laughs> and then the last candle they got was Girlfriend. And I'm pretty sure that once again, I have this um, from last year or the year before. Because I'm pretty sure the ones that they've come out with before were Vampire Blood, Girlfriend and Pumpkin Carving. Um, so the Midnight Spell and the Moon the Graveyard were new this year. So at least new to Australia or that I'd seen. So this one is Dark Strawberries, Ghostly, Peony, Spine Chilling Citrus. And that smells so good. From Bath and Body Works, if you've ever smelled saltwater taffy, it kind of smells a bit like that. I really, really like this one. So good. I think the Halloween collection, they all smell so amazing this year. They've done a really good job. Ah! Yum! I love it. So those were all of the candles I got. So there was, what? five is that right and then the body care was kind of weird like i didn't there wasn't matching body care to all of the scents but i got some of the body care so so i got three shower gels we got midnight spell which i'm so excited about because once again this was one of my favorites from the collection and it smells so good it's kind of a little bit reminiscent of bombshell by victoria's secret if you smell that oh i'm obsessed i love it then i got everlasting magic did I get that in a candle? Am I missing a candle? Did I not get that in a candle? Let me check my... Let me check my order. Because I don't know why I would have got it like... I definitely didn't read that out, did I? No, apparently I didn't. That's really random. Maybe they didn't have a candle for this one. I don't know. But anyway, Everlasting Magic. This is Bejeweled Berries, Phantom Petals and Magic Musk. Ooh, it smells really good. I'm very sad that they don't have a candle like that because that smells really good. Mm. Definitely smells like something I've smelled before, like from Bath and Body Works, but I don't know. Yeah, it smells really good. And then I also got a Vampire Blood shower gel. Oh, it smells really good. Once again. So, and then the last thing that I got was the Everlasting Magic um, 24 hour hydration cream. And this really annoys me because it's off center. I don't know if you can see that, but like the pattern is like off center and it's off center as well on the back. So I don't know what happened there, but that annoys me. <laughs> but yeah, that was everything that I got. I was so excited. Um, Halloween is in a couple of days, but I Halloween is one of my favourite times of the year. I just think it's amazing. I wish that Australia was a bit more like America, where they got fully on board with it. But maybe one day. I feel like we've come a long way in the last couple of years, so can't complain too much. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you got anything from Bath and Body Works Halloween collection, let me know down below. Yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.